Welcome back, this is Yamma Jack. <clears throat> Got Outpost, Gunslinger, Hell on Earth. Starting in the worst possible starting location. I'm gonna set it upstairs and uh, I'll use the washroom for one. Which, uh, let me tell you, that was good. I really had to use the washroom there. Drink too much water. You're not supposed to drink as quickly as I do, but I, like, I drink it because I need to, because I'm talking a lot. And then I also, I just, I don't stop drinking it because I also just really like water. Um, so, it turns into a whole thing, really. But, you know, hey. Come on now. But that small break, it, uh, it takes me out of the recording, like, uh, rhythm, you know? And it takes me out of the KF2 rhythm. I'm not, uh, I'm not as confident anymore, I'm not as capable, it's kind of, uh, been a little bit of a break, and I'm noticing the, uh, the reduced killing floor 2 and then commentative efficacy, you know? Like, look at those misses, look at those whips. Great. Anyway, I'm really looking forward to working on this uh, this script to get. I've, I, I've just I've been thinking about uh, how I'm gonna make the script work, right? For for grabbing the perk and the map and all that. And honestly, I think I've got a pretty good idea for it. I'm gonna have it show a picture from some part of the video. It's gonna pick a, a random like halfway in the video. Um, and then it's going to show me that picture with, like, some, uh, input fields, which will be automatically filled out based on what it thinks the video is. Um, so, then I'll be able to fill out it if it's wrong, or accept it if it's right, which the perk will usually be right, and at least for the time being, the map will usually be wrong. Or, I mean, for the time being, the map's probably not even going to be filled out automatically. It'll probably just be the perk. But then I just have to type in what the map is. It'll have, like, some autocomplete based on the, the images that I have. And, um, it'll just be, it'll be great. It'll be a nice little thing, much, much easier. Uh, it'll move all the things over, upload them all. And, uh, just make my life just that much easier, you know? Just take that, uh, that stress off my back with the whole having to upload them and... Worrying about all that kind of stuff. I mean, that's just stuff that I don't like having to do. And if I can get a script to do that for me. I mean, I like making the script. And then it makes my life easier. It's like it's win-win. So I'm super, super excited to get onto that. It's kind of distracting me, actually, from... Uh, I was thinking even <laughs> when I came back to my computer after uh, my, my short little break there. I was like, what if instead of recording more, I just made the script? Big brain time, you know? Is that what the kids are saying these days? Is big brain? I think so, right? So I was thinking, you know, hey, I could just go and do that. Because I'm just, I'm super hyped to go do it. It's, it sounds like just a ton of fun. I also got to work on the, the RuneScape toolkit thing that I'm working on too, though. So, I mean, there's just so many different things that I want to be working on. So little time to do it all, you know? So little time. I want, I want the days to be longer. And then also you have to sleep less. Really, I just don't want to sleep. You know how much time is wasted sleeping? We don't even know why we sleep. Like, we know that it's, it gives us our energy. We know, we, I know that when I sleep, I feel better when I wake up. Like, I feel more energized and awake. And, like, I'm not tired anymore. But why do we get tired in the first place? And why does sleeping help that? Because our brain is still working, right? Like, you can still see the brain doing stuff. Right, the brain's that it's dreams and whatnot, right? Like your brain is still functional. So why are you like what are you getting out of it? We don't we don't even I don't even know like we know some stuff, we know a little bit about it, but like ultimately, as far as I'm aware, we don't really fully understand like why we dream. Or or why we I, mean, I don't think we know at all about why we dream. No, I think we know exactly why we dream. Because our brain is just like, Oh my god, what's happening? We need to Panic. Um, but I don't know if we know why we have to sleep. It's kind of a conundrum. 
And I don't like it. You know how many chevrons I could have robbed while I'm sleeping? How much extra time I would have had? It's just... So much time. I mean, I'd just be spending it doing, you know, random garbage like what I do now anyway, but... It's not like I'd be more productive. Especially not relative to other people, because the other thing you gotta realize is that, you know, if I don't have to sleep, then chances are other people also don't have to sleep. So... I'm not going to just suddenly be more productive than other people. I'm still going to be, relatively speaking, less productive than people who are more productive than me right now. Um, I just will get more done than, like, me, normally. You know, like, if that makes sense? Like, I'll be more productive than me when I sleep if I don't have to sleep, but other people also don't have to sleep. So, like, relatively speaking, I'm still going to be just as capable as I am now. Or I'll be just as impressive, I guess. You know what I mean? Like, if I don't have to sleep, I get more done, but everybody gets more done, so the fact that I get more done doesn't really... I'm still I'm still doing relatively the same amount to, to what other people do. You know what I mean? Like, does that make sense? Like, the whole not having time thing, everybody has to sleep eight hours a day. We're already, like, on pretty even footing, you know? Moving to a different even footing isn't gonna give you an advantage, you know what I mean? Okay, I want you to chase me. Because I can't really get a good spot down there for him to, to take him out, you know? This is enough bullets to take out a flesh pound. Okay, see ya. I'm out. I'm leaving. I'm done. Peace! Oh, I'm so excited to work on this, this, this script. It's gonna be so much fun. I've got I've got a decent bit done making the the episode things. That's that's been fun. I'm so excited to get on the rest of it though. You know, it's just it's gonna be so much fun. It's so many things that I've never done before, and I know I've talked about it like forever ago, and I was excited about it then for a similar reason. That just so many things I've never done, so many things that I have to learn. But genuinely. I have been thinking about how I'm going to make it work, and I haven't been able to figure out any way that I could personally actually do it. I'm like, I can learn, but like, I just, I haven't had the motivation to go and learn how to do it the way I was thinking I'd have to do it. And, uh, I had a, I had a bit of a eureka moment in one of those earlier episodes, and I'm gonna, I'm, I've got that, that excitement, it's there, I have an idea of how I'm going to do it. It's, it's doable, I don't have to learn anything, it's... Just straight doable. I can. I am capable of it. You know. I can probably take you out, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. I do not have many bullets left. Don't have any more. Yeah, I've got. I'm. I'm, I'm a little bit. Not in a good position here. You know. You got a husk, which uh, you know, it's fine, and a bloat, which also fine, and uh, whatever you are. See ya. Count that as one. What do you mean? That's count that. I won. I literally won. I literally won, though. <laughs> Let's count that as a win. Yeah. Okay. Whatever you say. I've been working a little bit with the YouTube API recently for the uh, the website. So I got my key, and I've got uh, familiarized with the API at this point, the YouTube Data API 3v3. I mean, it's it's a little bit of an annoying thing, honestly, to, to be working on. Because uh, the, the one that I, like, I wanted to make it all client-side, right? But I had to use the server in order to, to grab all of the YouTube episodes. Like, you can't just, there's no, like, end point for just getting all of the uh, YouTube videos for a channel. You know, like, you can't just do that on, um on the YouTube API, like you have to, you have to have an API key with it. And I'm like, okay, well, I don't want to share the API key with everybody, so I can't put it in JavaScript. And then you can, you can set up the like cross origin response thing um, to restrict it so that only the API key can only be used for requests coming from yamachack.com. But I'm like, well, people can just like pass the request through my website anyway, right? Or like just spam it on there anyway. Like it's still giving people the API key. They can still abuse it, even if it makes it harder for them to do it. And that, I just I don't I don't really feel comfortable with that. 
I mean, I'm sure it's safe. Like, they, they made it, and they allow you to do it, so... Like, that's how, like, if you look up how to do it on, on JavaScript, like, that's the official way to do it, is, is to, to, res to restrict it like that. If you have to have it be visible, then that's what you do, right? But it's just, I have PHP, I know how to use it, you know, like, just, just do it that way, right? Just do it the, the definitely not gonna get me in trouble way, right? But, it would be nice, it would be so much nicer if there were just an endpoint that I could go to, to, that didn't require a key. You know? But I guess in a, in a similar vein... Well, no, because I'd be able to put it on the client side, so like the... They'd be able to just... Like, block requests from specific IPs that are spamming it, instead of blocking my API key, you know? I guess that's a little bit more hard to handle and like more server-sided power for them, but it would just be easier for me as a, as a user, you know? Well, not really user. I'm a developer, but, you know. I'm a, I'm a user of the API, a developer from, from your perspective, right? Just depends on how you look at it. Am I a developer or a user? I mean, who knows, really, right? Oh, man. I should have been using the, the Glocks a little bit more there, but it's okay. That's okay. Got a little bit tilted, it's fine. We still got past the 10 minute mark, I'm still... There's still some commentary there. You don't watch for the game anyway, right? That's gonna do it for today though, thank you for watching. Remember to like the video if you like it, subscribe to see more in the future, comment if you have anything to say, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.